Hello, hello, hello! It's time to talk fashion! Let's begin. To be very honest, the studio headphones is probably like a mid-tier kind of gear, but when I wear it, it's like high tier, like the highest of tiers, if you know what I mean. Just picture it, like every other person who probably wears the studio headphones, it just doesn't look as good on them as it looks as good on me. It looks great on me. Let I me mean, look at me. Moving on to, obviously, the rugby shirt. This is like very, very OG me. I mean, I don't wear this shirt as much, but in Splatoon 1 times, uh, I thought it was just like, you know, this is just like a very smart looking shirt, you know, it's it's just decent, you know, it's, it's there's nothing bad about it, there's nothing good about it, so I'll just wear it, why not? Nowadays, I would probably opt into a, like a white shirt. Sometimes I wear this shirt, shirt like this looks pretty cool, you know, look, making the, I can make long sleeves work. The hoodies as well, I mean, look at that, that looks quite fine if you ask me. Alright, so the blue moto boots. Now, not a lot of people really like these shoes for whatever reason. I can still make it work because you see with the cargo shirt, shorts uh, that I wear on my inkling. It just kind of works with each other. Probably didn't look as good in Splatoon 1, but that it, that it does in Splatoon 2s, but you know, it's pretty alright. Nowadays though, I tend to wear these like plimsoll kind of shoes, like the skater kind of shoes. I am a skateboarder in real life, so you know, it's just something that attracts me quite a lot. Because I have actually, in IRL, I have a lot of shoes like this. But yeah, the Moto boots are pretty good. They look good on my feet. Probably doesn't look good on many other people's feet, but mine, it, it's pretty pog. Oh yeah, the hairstyle. That's probably something we could talk about. Original Splatoon 1 look. A lot of people have asked me, why haven't you changed your hair? Dude, you're bold. You're bold IRL. Look at this. Like, why don't you change hair? You don't have hair. Who, who, who are you faking this to? Well, it looked good in Splatoon 1, and I figured my inkling looks cool like that. So why change it? Hell no am I switching to the bold cut in this game. That's actually trash. Or the spiky hair look, which is probably the worst haircut you can see in Splatoon. It's awful actually. I, I, I always call people out on it. So yeah, the original hairstyle, the OG Splatoon 1 style, this is here to stay till Splatoon 3, my people. So yes, my drip.